Sometimes Windows updates can cause performance issues and even blue screens. That's why today I will show you 5 methods how to disable updates in Windows 11. And believe me, one of these methods will definitely help you. So let's get started. So friends, we are in the Windows 11 and let's proceed to the first method. For the first method, we will use Windows services. We need to hit Win plus R. Then we need to type next. Services dot msc services dot msc then you need to click ok or press enter here we are in the services now we need to scroll down a little bit until we will find windows update so we need to scroll down please pay attention and take your time because you can accidentally select microsoft update health services and it's not that we need we need to scroll down one more time we need to find just a windows update scroll down to the bottom and finally we found a windows update so you need to click on the rightmost button select stop click on it wait a sec but that's not all. One more time, you need to click on the right mouse button. Select Properties. Now we are in Windows Update Properties, Local Computer. You need to find Startup Type. As you can see, at the moment we have Automatic, but we need to click on it and select Disable. After this, you need to click Apply and click OK. So yep, we disable update in Windows 11 using services. Now we can close this window and we will proceed to the second method. Block Windows 11 update with group policy editor. So one more time, again we need to hit Win plus R. But this time we need to type next. GP edit dot msc. GP edit dot msc. Click OK. I will open it in full screen to make it more convenient. Do it this way. In the upper left corner, you need to find a local computer policy. Click on it, then select computer configuration. From computer configuration, you need to navigate to administrative templates. Then you need to move the mouse cursor down until you will find Windows components. Select Windows components. After this process, you need to scroll down a little bit until you will find a Windows Update. As you can see, Windows Update, just click on it. One more time, I will move it to the right side. Good. From Windows Update, you need to navigate to Manage and User Experience. You need to click on it. On the right side of the screen, you need to find Configure Automatic Updates. Just click on it, double click. Okay, one more time I will open it in full screen. In this window, we need to do one very important thing. As you can see, at the moment we have not configured and we need to select disabled. Select disabled. After that, click apply. Select OK. And voila, we just turn off Windows 11 update using group policy editor. Now we can close this window and proceed to the third method. Stop Windows 11 update with registry editor. Again and again, hit Win plus R and type next. Reg edit dot X. Reg edit dot X. Press enter. Select yes. Here we are in the registry editor. In the upper left corner, we need to find computer. Click on it. Then you need to select HQ local machine. Yep, after that you need to select software and from software we need to navigate to policies. So move the mouse cursor here to the policies, select policies, then you will find Microsoft folder, click on it, scroll down one more time, select Windows and from this place please pay attention and take your time because it is very important moment. Now you need to click on the rightmost button, then you need to click on new key, click on it and enter next. Windows update. Windows update, press enter. Good. 
And that's not all. One more time, you need to click on the rightmost button, but this time on Windows Update. Click on it. Again, select New Key. But this time, you need to type A U. Understood. A U. Press Enter. Now select A U. And on the right side, you need to click on the rightmost button and create a new D Word 32 bit value. Click on it. Please pay attention and type next. No. Auto. Update. No. Auto. Update. Press Enter. After you created 32 bit value file, you need to click on it. Double click. And I will move it to the middle of the screen to make it more convenient. In value data, you need to type 1 because 0 will be not suitable, so please type 1. Also, in the base menu, be sure to select hexadecimal and click OK. Now we can close this window and it is necessary to restart the system. So you need to click here and restart your laptop or PC. Let's talk about the basic method, how to pause Windows Update in Windows 11. So for this, you need to click on the startup menu, navigate to settings. From settings, you need to navigate to Windows Update. And in Windows Update, here you may see option pause for one week. Also, you can click here and pause for five weeks, for the example. That's mean after five weeks, you need to one more time repeat hold the process. So it is not lifetime tip, but if you don't want to mess with registry, with policy group editor or Windows services, you can just use this basic tip. Click on pause for five weeks. And voila, as you can see, it works for real. Update pause. So now we can close this window. And let's talk about the last method. Because it is quite interesting method. We will use utility troubleshooter from the Microsoft. Yes, such a utility exists. And it can for real disable update in Windows 11. To use this utility, first of all, we need to download it. And to download this utility, we will go to the Microsoft official website. Link I will leave in the video description. As you can see, download microsoft.com. So don't worry about this. It is not a virus. Now you need to open your browser, Microsoft Edge browser or Chrome browser or any other browser. It doesn't matter. In my case, I will open Google Chrome browser. Then you need to pass the link. Press enter and it will automatically download on your laptop or PC. After this, we can click on it and it will automatically run. I will close the browser to make it more convenient. One more time, I want to mention this utility is downloaded from the Microsoft official website. So don't worry about some virus or malware. Here we can see next show or hide updates. In this case, we need to click on next. Detecting problems. Just wait a sec. Updates improve the security and performance of your computer, but if an update isn't working, you can temporarily hide it. And that's what we're going to do. We need to click on hide update, click on it. Actually, I run this utility in virtual box, so I don't have a lot of options, but in this window, probably you will see more options. So you need to enable all of them. If you wish, you may not check Microsoft Defender update because it is your security and it is very important. All other features you can check and click on next. Also, this process may take a few seconds. You just need to wait and be patient. Troubleshooting has completed. We see the green mark here and fixed. So we can close this window. My friends, I showed five different methods how to disable updates in Windows 11. And I hope one of these methods will be suitable for you and work without any problems or issues. If this video was useful for you, please like it and I recommend watching this video on how to disable Microsoft Defender in Windows 11.